Hi guys, Hamza here and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create SVG images and use them in Elementor. The main beauty about SVG images is that they are scalable and they can work really well in responsive environments. That means that if you create an icon like this, it can be easily viewed on different devices without losing the quality. And the beauty about SVG images, they are not bitmap. They are based on XML and they can always be changed on the size. You can switch from different colors to another. Let's dive straight in and see how we can create and use our SVG images in Elementor. To start off, I'm going to show you how you can access or create SVG icons uh, both in Elementor and using uh, Illustrator and on the other hand, getting some icons from uh, digital resources. For example, there are so many other websites, but I, I just want to take you through a website called Flat Icon. So Flat Icon is a very uh, big resource of uh, vector icons, graphics, and a lot more other things. In case you are looking for a specific icon to use in your web project, you can just simply come over here and search maybe like laptop, and then uh, you are able to choose between either you want to get an icon of a laptop or you just basically want a vector or an image or something like that. In this case, we are looking for icons. Let me say I can come over here. And then I have the option to download an SVG image and I can easily download here and I have it on my computer. And I can get this icon and use it in my web project. Just like here, I'm basically using a template. I can import that icon. I just come over here, get icon, drop it in Elementor, delete this. So now we have our icon element here, so we can easily upload an SVG image, come over here, downloads then we look up for the one we just downloaded and we are good to go so open so once we have the icon we can just insert the media and uh, we can now start working around our icon we can you know increase the size we can give it any color we wish we can do a lot more other modifications we can do anything so that is if we are going to use uh, graphic resources, uh, digital graphic resources. It can be Flat Icon, it can be any other platform. So this video is not sponsored by Flat Icon or anything like that. Once you are able to find out a platform where you can get such icons, you can always get them from there. But the other way you can also get SVG icons is by actually using the Elementor icon library. So let's try it out by simply getting our icon. Come over here icon come to the icon library and we have thousands of icons here that Elementor put together we can choose any icon we want let me just search laptop and we have this here so we can insert and still we can work on it the way we want we can do so many tweaks we can change color also uh, we can do a lot more other modifications just like we did with any of these other icons. The other way actually to get SVG icons is actually to create your own icons. So we can do that with a number of graphic softwares, but in this case I'm going to show you around with Adobe Illustrator by going to File, New, and then we can create a new file. And then we can create our icons. So let me just create something here shape like this you know we can have as many says or whatever then we can give it a fill and then uh, maybe we can also uh, bring in another shape you know something like this and it also has a fill of black so we can just have something simple like this we can just crop out the whole of this white space 
and we have something just like that and then we just come to file save as so we can save the format as svg uh, we can uh, name it demo is demo svg then we can save you have these preferences to choose from i'll leave everything just as they are default then i say okay then i'm done i'm done saving my svg then i come over to my elementor block i have to add the icon element icon which is this but i already even have it here so i'll just bring this over just to show you and then here i have my icon element then i can upload an svg come over here browse our svg then we named it demo demo.svg and then we can import and insert media boom we have our svg imported so we can also make any other tweaks we want with our svg image we can rotate svg we can uh, change you know a lot more other things to stacked to framed to all that stuff so guys that's how you can actually create and use svg images in elementor just a recap three ways you can actually get svg images you can use the elementor icon library you can use digital platforms and then you can also create your own svg images if you like this video don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so that you don't miss out on new content when i push it out and hey also don't forget to smash the like button thank you so much for watching and see you in my next tutorial